Hey guys, this morning, several people sent me messages about this problem right here. I think it was part of some test in the UK. A lot of students struggled with this one. And apparently, according to some news sites, a lot of parents couldn't figure it out either. So let's do it. So this is the problem exactly as it was given to me. We have a shape here with some of the measurements in terms of X. And it says the area of the shape is A centimeters squared. And we want to show that A is equal to 2X squared plus 24X plus 46. So I'm thinking first, let's cut this into two parts. Now we've split it into two rectangles. The area of a rectangle is base times height. So for this one up here, it'd be 4 times X plus 1. And then and the area of this rectangle will also be base times height, but we don't know this height right here. This x plus 11 is the height of the whole figure. So we got to figure out this side length right here. So we can say this entire height x plus 11 is going to be equal to this question mark distance plus the 4, because they're both the height of the original figure. From here, we can subtract 4 from both sides, and we get x, 11 minus 4 is 7. And then these two 4s cancel, leaving us with just the question mark. This question mark is equal to x plus 7. So let's change this question mark into x plus 7. We don't need this anymore. And now we can find the area of this rectangle. It's going to be this base times this height. So now to find the area of this whole figure, we're going to take the area of this upper rectangle and add to it the area of this lower rectangle. So now let's clean this up. We're going to do some distribution. We're going to multiply the 4 times the x, which is 4x, and then the 4 times the 1, which is 4. And then we'll do the same thing here. We'll do 2x times x, which is 2, and then x times x is x squared. And then we'll do 2x times 7. 2 times 7 is 14, and then we still have an x. Then we'll do 6 times x, which is 6x. And then we'll do 6 times 7, which is 42. And now we can combine like terms. We have one x squared term, so we'll just bring that down. And now we're done with that. We have three x terms. 4x plus 14x is 18x plus 6 is 24x. And now we're done with all those. And then we have two constant terms. 4 plus 42 is equal to 46. And now we're done with those. So this right here is the area of our original figure. And this is what they wanted us to show. And we did exactly that. How exciting.